Well, good morning, YouTube. This is David, the Georgia photographer. Today, I am at the Rich Grissom Memorial Wetlands. It's also called the Vieira Wetlands. You might be able to hear the truck idling behind me. This is a bird sanctuary. As you can see, it's all lakes. So what I'm gonna try to do is get a bunch of photos while I'm here. I was sent down by uh, Phil Thatch. His channel's right here. He's been here before as well. Link to his video. Hopefully I can actually get them in together. It'll populate just as soon as YouTube will allow it. And you should really go watch that vlog. It's, it's good. So I'm gonna see about some photos here and see what I can get of this wildlife at this reserve and enjoy the morning. I've got a couple of hours and then we're heading on over to Orlando and I hear a bird in this tree over here too. And I got my attention, but let's do this. Today's weapon of choice is the Nikon D810, the Nikon 1.4X teleconverter and the two to 500 Nikkor Super Zoom. This gives me 700 millimeters at F8 and in the direct sun or in, in sunny conditions, that's plenty of light for this lens. I'm shooting at uh, some kind of ridiculous shutter speed. It's averaging one two thousandth to one sixteen hundred. You know, I got an aperture priority for this endeavor. So let's go get this thing out. I've come out here to this wetlands and I've got pictures of those birds. I think they're buzzards. And I've got pictures of these little birds in the sun right here. They're walking around in the edge of the water, getting something to eat for breakfast. I think they're called coromites, coromites or something to that effect. There's a bunch of those here. There's an abundance of them. There's a bunch of these white birds. They're white birds. I'm not sure the name of them either. I'm terrible at these bird names. I found some cute little songbirds. There was a few playing in the edges of the weeds on the side of the road. You just drive around in this place. As you can see, the road just travels through it. It just meanders back and forth through all these wetlands. And see, there's the truck. The girls are in the truck right now. You just stop along the way. I've went through the middle. Everybody is driving around the perimeter, but nobody is driving through the middle. So I basically have the center to myself. I can just do what I want. I don't have to try and pull over and get out of the way for other cars. I think one car went by the whole time I've been out here. It's actually really, really nice. I keep finding these little cute birds, so I keep stopping and taking pictures of them. But yeah, I've got a picture of a bird with a lot of black and some color on its wing, and a gray bird with a striped eye. And yeah, those are the technical names I know. We're gonna go up on this observation deck with the vultures. Can you see this? Look, they're hanging out. Let's see how long it takes them. Let's see if I can get close enough to get a that gum. Uh, I should be able to get a really good shot. Oh, oh, I spooked one. He flew across the handrail. <laughs> All right, see if I can get a photo of this. All right, here we go. Let's see how far, how close I can get before they fly away. Uh, <laughs> They're just walking across the handrail. They're not really trying to leave. <laughs> hey guys, how y'all this morning? Y'all y'all gonna leave finally? Okay. Nope, nope, nope. Yeah, finally. <laughs> Seems the closest that a vulture will let you get to them is about 15 feet. <laughs> oh, and they lit in the road. <laughs> This should give me an interesting photo. Oh boy, everybody. No, they're still on the perimeter. Okay, good. Yeah, I can still go that way. That's the end of the video until I get a battery. But the audio is still running because I'm recording it separately. Been looking for a gator. I ain't seen one yet. Supposedly they're out here, which this is central Florida. They should be here. But like I said, I ain't seen one. Been kind of keeping my eye peeled, hoping to find one of them too. It is kind of cool today, so they may be in the water trying to stay warm because they're reptiles and all. But 
there's a lot of birds. If you like to photograph birds, this is a pretty good place. What I thought I was seeing as a raptor earlier was I think was just a vulture. But it seems like they pull their head in when they fly so their neck isn't strung out and because they do that, it makes them look more like a hawk or something than flight. But yeah, we're gonna move on and see what else we can find. As we finish up our trip through the Vieira wetlands, there's like 43,262 birds of some kind over on that little island. And everybody has stopped to photograph it. Yep. And it's kind of created a log jam of cars. That's so, oh, uh, <laughs> yeah, here comes another car. There's a guy walking up the road behind us, see, up there. He's up behind my truck. And these people are coming by. That's tiring morning hmm? You're in fire ant. i'm standing in fire ants oh boy that's always fun it's but exciting. but yeah this is a really beautiful place and there's lots of opportunities um, the birds will get right on the side of the road i even like photograph songbirds that literally flew up and lit in the grass beside me it's a beautiful place if you get an opportunity to come down here it's it's a drive-through park you can pull over and cars will go around you but it's available to the public it's free that says something. There ain't much in Florida that's free, and it's free. They take donations to maintain it. But yeah, there's an abundance of cattails. So you have to kind of look through the reeds and cattails to find the animals, but they're everywhere. They're literally on the side of the road. And if you just pay attention, uh, the girls were trying to let me know uh, while I was photographing, I think it's a coromot. I'm thinking that's what it is, some kind of bird with a long curved beak that fishes with it. I was photographing one and another and literally walked across the road right behind me. I had no idea. You know, they're just everywhere. And I got this little bird silhouetted by the sun. Oh, there's some deer. Look right here. Come here, quick. Okay. See them over there? There's a bunch of deer. I'm shooting 700 mils so I can get them in frame. Got them just in time. Yeah, that was a freebie. That's the first. Oh, look, is that a gator? Ah, uh, it's a log. It's not a gator. We just thought it was. <laughs> but like I said, we've been here for about an hour and a half. We're about to head on up to Orlando now. This is David, the Georgia photographer, and I appreciate you following along on my trip to the Vieira wetlands and the girls heckling me from inside the truck. Sierra even got a little video footage of what it looks like to be the family of a vlogger. <laughs> so. With that, <laughs> get your camera out and go take a picture with it. All right, we'll see y'all.